Hello, my name is Solar Teddy Bear or M and welcome to my channel. This video is mostly going to be a formal introduction to me and what my content will mostly be. I think I'll make a video like this like I don't know, once a year just to keep the channel up to date. Stick around for a bit of an idea for future content. To start off at the time of recording this, I am 16 years old and I'm a gender, meaning I don't have or identify with any gender. It's under the non-binary spectrum. I use mostly any pronouns, however if you're unsure of the ones I mainly decide to go by at the moment, just use they, it for me. I am a self-taught artist and animator, and while I don't really intend for art and animation on YouTube to be a full career, I do intend for it to be something I can earn some side money doing, sort of like financial cushion for if a job in the workforce doesn't work out or something happens. And also because I'm very, very passionate about my work, especially revolving around my OCs or original characters and their backstories. Now onto the kind of content I intend to create. The videos I'm more likely to make are animation memes, Regular animations, me talking about a character's lore and backstory over a speed paint of a character, stuff like that. My last video sharing the lore on one of my main characters, The Embodiment, actually did really well compared to my other content normally. So I'm really, really happy about that. I was extremely happy to see like people actually enjoy me info dump <laughs> about my characters and that just made me really, really happy. I'm not crying, by the way. I'm just happy. <laughs> I'm not crying. Please. And on those side of videos, it's going to be like an occasional story time over speed paint, maybe commentary, maybe gameplay video or two. Those last three are going to be like, I'm not too passionate about, but I'm still like, I have an interest in doing that. Now I'm going to say this now, just to be sure. But my upload schedule will not be consistent. Consistency is something I lack severely. I am not good at being consistent. And I've just kind of learned to embrace that with stuff it's like optional to be consistent about. So, you know, might as well. How much or how often I make stuff, it just depends on my motivation and how I'm feeling. I could make multiple videos in one week, one time, and then only one video a month the next time <laughs> however i do want to at least try to make one video a month hopefully two as scripting and editing these videos all by myself takes time alongside being a solo animator and still in high school i'm more than happy to sacrifice consistency and quantity of videos for more high quality content the main videos i plan on posting soon is a backstory and origin video on lindell a choice animation meme and an animation meme of that funny Markiplier video where he goes like, What if, what I, if I didn't, didn't run? run? What if what I'm if not, not a coward? coward? To like that <laughs> buff Spongebob game. I really forgot what the um, game was, but I remember like they were playing a Squidward and <laughs> and, they're, and they're like people Krabby Patties or something. I can't really remember much, but it was a while ago and I remember that. Also, a bit of a heads up. I say that my main content source will be like, lore or backstory videos on my OCs and I know what you're thinking. I know, I know. Oh, but Em, you don't have a lot of OCs. How can you do that when you don't have that many OCs? Em, there's only so much content you can make with that. No. No, I have over 70 OCs. Only a small handful of them don't have a lore or backstory. A small handful of 70. That number may either increase or decrease but I'm betting on it increasing. I am too attached to them. <laughs> I'm too attached to my OCs. I have 70. And I want an info dump about all of them. Every single one. <laughs> I'm very passionate <laughs> about this. To be honest, I think the main reason why I have so many is because I think of a cool design for a character partnered with like a little character trait or backstory that makes them so cool to me. Like how I made a character based entirely on like me liking white hair and yellow or orange eyes on characters and how I also like those girl boss characters are like the epitome of a walking big sister trope and I just turned that into an entire character <laughs> and I'd be like oh my god this is so awesome I love this character <laughs> and I just keep that the entire time and there's like nothing to them unless I add on stuff and I just also like making character designs I 
love making character designs i love redesigning my characters it's like it's so much fun low-key it's the best thing i love redesigning <laughs> i love making designs and actually a small handful of my characters came from dreams i've had like i just had a dream and i woke up and went that'd be a cool character idea oh my god <laughs> and well they're a character now i can like name one he's like a weird rainbow slime in the dream i had he was in i was like playing a little princess <laughs> i was i was a little princess okay and the character was um a little rainbow slime and i was like oh my god rainbow slime in the dream and i was like oh my god rainbow slime when i woke up i could go on and on about my dreams and how many characters i have connected to those dreams but i'll save that for another video because this is already getting to six and a half minutes long in the unedited script so yeah i hope to see you soon and stay tuned for future content and me info dumping about every single thing i've ever learned in my life goodbye